Right, well, a bunch of tree huggers in the agency, mostly with beards, came to me and said, is there anything we can do to reduce the agency's environmental footprint, you know, to offset the cost of your jag and so forth? And I said, well, what have you got in mind? And they said, well, paper towels for some reason. I said, well, look, the thing is, in terms of using behavioural science to reduce the use of paper towels, we've already done a really good job in this, in a kind of ahead-of-its-time nudge, which is that we've hidden the paper towels so they're completely invisible to anyone over four feet in height. And they said, well, apart from that, people have actually worked out where they are, the people who work here permanently, so is there something else we can do just to reduce the amount of paper people typically use? And I said, well, look, when we move to the new building, we can install those whizzy Dyson um, warm air dryers, which have the miraculous property of actually drying your hands. And they said, fair news, but what can we do in the meantime? And I said, oh, go on, you don't give up, do you? And we found a video on TED, which made the point that about uh, half a billion pounds of uh, paper towels are used in America's offices every year. If everybody could just reduce to one towel per hand wash instead of the typical three or four, the difference it would make would be absolutely spectacular. So I said, OK, I'll watch the video and I'll give it a go. Now here, apparently, is what you do. First of all, wash your hands uh, enthusiastically uh, using some of the soap when, by some miracle, it's actually available. Uh, then rinse them thoroughly. Now here's the extra bit. Shake any particular fashion you like 12 times. I think I've been 12 times here. 12 is a bit of an arbitrary number, but you'll notice that by about 9 or 10, there's a substantial reduction in wetness of hands. Then take one towel, and probably one way you can do it is just to increase the use of the surface area. Fold it into three. You can actually refold it if you want to. By the time you've done that shaking, with one simple towel, hands completely dry. Now the best thing about this is it's not done to save Ogilvy money, just in case you're starting to have suspicions here, because our towels are all paid for as part of our service contract. So the great news is if you do this, you won't be saving WPP any money at all. So it's just for the good of the planet. So next time, there'll be notices to remind you and nudge you, shake 12 times, one sheet, we're all doing our bit. Next week on Rory's Behavioural Tips, how to wipe your own arse. Thank you very much.